a hot bath or a soak in hot water raises our body temperature. Several benefits of this rise include improved blood circulation, improved lymph circulation, detoxification, increased metabolism, and a calmer nervous system. It had been a long work of leisure. A long work. Too many good times and we needed a holiday. We sought out an expensive Japanese style bath in the Blue Mountains. The man also sunk into the water with us was looking very serious. The result can be a healthier and more relaxed you. The best part is that soaking in hot water is inexpensive, pleasurable, and an easy way to access these benefits. Let's look closer. In those summers when it was cracking hot and the solar heater was still working, the pool would easily get up to 38 degrees. Harry had no idea how long a bath he would need to take to work out the secret of the golden egg. He decided to do it at night, when he would be able to take as much time as he wanted. The water might have been cloudy from the algae we'd scrape off the sides, but we'd swim through it anyway, despite Mrs. Tefe's concern. I left the bath and scribbled a note about a story about summer and ju the juxtaposition between that hot water and this hot water. We got banned from the pool for the rest of that summer for jumping off the fence above it. It was Ryan's fault. Reluctant though he was to accept more favors from Cedric, he also decided to use the prefect's bathroom. Far fewer people were allowed in there, so it was much less likely that he would be disturbed. In a hot spring, everything is clear, and you feel like you don't need to think about anything. You lay your head back against the edge of the bath and feel the water in your hair cooling and dripping off onto the stone. The reviving qualities of a hot bath have been celebrated from Homer onwards. In Book 22 of the Iliad, Hector's wife heats a cauldron of water over a fire for him to soak after his epic battle with Achilles. Unfortunately, Hector ends up beyond the reach of baths. It was too hot to do any thinking or to say anything meaningful, so we just lay there listening to our neighbor's gossip. I closed my eyes and felt wonderful. When Hitler came to power, I was in the bath. The oldest bathtub yet discovered is in the Queen's bathroom in the Palace of Nonos on Crete, dating from 1500 BC. It was made from five clay and sat alongside one of the earliest water-flushed lavatories. The water was hot and we were laying back in it, so clean, so relaxed. We had come all the way to Lithgow, so what is a little further? Take me there, further. I was thinking so clearly. I would throw out so much stuff when I got home. Hey Jasper, could you find or invent for me some German compound nouns about bathing? For example, the feeling of entering an extremely pleasurable warm bath. The feeling of cooling after you leave a very warm bath. The feeling of hot bath water 
cooling on the locks of your hair, which are suspended from the bar. Any compound nouns that help explain the amazing sensation of an onsen. It's for our project I'm doing, for Digital Rise Festival. It had been a glorious childhood, and every year I was getting more pragmatic. I wished I still had the idealism of when I was 18, but in a bath, it is just easier to let things slide. The water was bath hot in the pool that summer, and we would lay back in it and paddle around. If you're renovating your bathroom, selecting your new tub is one of the most important decisions you will make. The bath is often the focal point of your new bathroom, so it's critical that you make the right decision. In my opinion, quality counts, so I think you should buy the best quality that your budget allows. I feel old and boring, and I think the 18-year-old me probably wouldn't like me very much. Would think I was not an essential enough a person, I think, in the bath. Endurance. Duration. These are things worth working for. Bathing is the washing of the body with a fluid, usually water or an aqueous solution, or the immersion of the body in water. There was another bather with us, looking very serious. My experience of the bath became profound, because I could watch him having what I felt a profound experience would look like, based on my reading of Ben Lerner. The physics of displacement was discovered by Archimedes while he was soaking in a bathtub. Nothing crisper than the feeling of feeling clear and hot and present in a bath and the way you can't write anything or take any photos or do much at all except enjoy it. We would all be happier in baths. It may be practiced for personal hygiene, religious ritual, or therapeutic purposes. By analogy, especially as a recreational activity, the term is also applied to sunbathing and sea bathing. When I got home, I would throw out so much stuff. The clothes I've stored away for the winters that Sydney never has, and the colorful things I never wear that might be good for a costume party, the books I'll never read, and general kinds of dust and crap. One theory for what causes wrinkly skin after a bath is that the outermost layer of skin, the stratum corneum, literally horned layer, contains dendritic cells which absorb water. This makes the surface of the skin swell, but not the lower layers, so the surface is forced to pucker as a result. When I got out of the bath, I would write more, get flow, use less electronics. I would go to Europe with all the scholarship money, just like Ben Lerner, without the weed, and keep everything fresh and new and untainted. His immediate reaction was that it would be worth becoming a prefect just to be able to use this bathroom. I would not try to essentialize every experience into totality. It was dangerous and I would end up idealizing myself and assuming I was capable of things which I was not. Much better to think, I will work hard on this one thing and do it well. It was softly lit by a splendid candle-filled chandelier and everything was made of white marble, including what looked like an empty rectangular swimming pool into the middle of the floor. We walked down the road after the bath, and David said that if I wanted him to work at the restaurant 14 hours a day, six days a week, and also finish his master's, then I should do my PhD full-time whilst also working four days at the publisher, and I laughed because it was ridiculous, but in that moment, after the bath, maybe we could. About a hundred golden taps stood all around the pool's edges each with a different colored jewel set into its handle. Nothing more relaxing than a little clarity of thought after a bath, and I would be clearer and a more streamlined person and do less extraneous things. I would be, perhaps, less solipsistic and more giving and open. There was also a diving board.
There's hot water, but I can't quite touch it. Back that many years, where are the inner city baths and what kind of business model would you need? And would they be overrun by nasties? Long white linen curtains hung at the windows. A large pile of fluffy white towels sat in a corner and there was a single golden framed painting on the wall. How much money do I need to have in savings before I can feasibly consider opening my own bathhouse? And if so, what sort of industry should I work in to support that investment? And do you know anybody in that industry? On the Titanic, more than 700 third-class passengers had to share only two bathtubs. It's a very simple thing. Your hair has a lot of hot water in it, and when you arch it back out of the bath and lay it in the stone, it cools rapidly, and the, wall, and the cooler water touches the back of your neck as it meets the stone, and it is very pleasant. It features a blonde mermaid who is fast asleep on a rock. Her long hair over her face, it fluttered every time she snored. And where Hemingway in this bath, what would he be thinking about? And why does describing a nice thing simply feel like writing he like Hemingway? Will Weisenfeld derives his name from his childhood memory of taking in art and music and by dwelling it on in his bathtub, which he claims he was very fond of. For example, a ritual religious bath is sometimes referred to as immersion. The use of water for therapeutic purposes can be called water treatment or hydrotherapy, and two recreational water activities are known as swimming and paddling. How much more afraid I am now of waves than that when I was 15, and we would pound ourselves against the shore at Coco. Those thick burgers and the Coca-Cola doing its marketing job on me. Always associating a salty, parched mouth with the need for a sweaty bottle of it. The hardest thing about an excellent bath is what you do afterwards. You're losing your cleanliness by the moment. Your clarity, your sense of... Yes, it is simple. You cannot concentrate. Your phone is out there and um, your many simulated and unstimulated thoughts. The city of Bath, known during ancient Roman times as Aquae Sulis, is famous for its public bars fed by hydrothermal springs. Mrs. Coote was the nicest of mums we carpooled with, mostly because she would buy us frosty fruits on the hot days. I would bathe every morning as a child. My mum would wake me up and go around the bath. It would be very low, maybe a quarter to a third full, nothing lux, and I would clean myself but also kind of nap in there before I got going, maybe for five to ten minutes. The rush out of the bath and through the cold air towards the tower would be the wake up I needed to get the day going. A hot spring is a spring that is produced by the emergence of geothermally heated groundwater from the Earth's crust. I haven't lived in a house with a proper bath in a very long time. My house in Marrickville had one, but it had a shitty one-person hot water tank, so it wouldn't even fill one bath. There are geothermal hot springs in many locations all over the crust of the earth. We went lilowing in the mountains a few weeks ago. That produced a few great moments of bath clarity. You get a shimmer from the water reflecting upon the rocks, and you think about the indescribability of that. You feel good. It's clear. It's a literal crystal image. It's there. It's present and irretrievable. The more irretrievable the moment felt at the time, the more meaningful it will appear in hindsight. That look in her eyes. You could capture that look in a photograph, but it would be full of performance, and that's a little different. Or if you're dating an actress, maybe it's both. I have a little bath clarity right now. Schaefer Library is a beautiful thing. My phone has run out of battery. I cannot connect to the internet. These are beautiful things. 
Where is my four and twenty pie electric wiki? And isn't this the lucky country? And what a catch! The city is famous for its Roman baths, but before the Roman invasion of Britain in 43 AD, Bath was a Celtic city dedicated to the goddess Sulis, who was said to keep the waters of the springs sacred. Let's take it up a notch. I wonder about masculinity and the gays and the beach. I used to like touch footy and chips and the suggestion of an undone bikini strap. And could I really have known better? I was a boy, just a boy, playing some sports on the beach. About 365 people drown in their bathtubs each year. Bath safety is critical. There are photos of my dad playing in the pool with us in his early 30s when we were little tykes. And he was really quite good looking. Not that I can remember. The voice inside the soundscape is happy to be overcome. He could tell at once that they carried different sorts of bubble bath mixed with the water. Though it wasn't bubble bath as Harry had ever experienced it. Glassworks begins. And immediately water flowing down a river gently. Immediately Lucian on his parents' piano. Mushroom risotto. Action. Calm. Water and the photography of water. Ship sailing and Truman hoping for home. Imagine living the only place you've known looking for hope and you're an explorer in a television show hanging onto the bath curtain saying, hold on! One tap cushed, gushed pink and blue bubbles the size of footballs. Another poured ice white foam so thick that when Harry thought it would have supported his weight if he'd care to test it. A third sent heavily perfumed purple clouds hovering over the surface of the water. Staccato or similar. And where are we in droplets down windows on cold mornings in Perisher and Easter? And you want, want to get up and go but you're in the bath? And you want to play cards with the boys and impress the girls, and you want to call someone at home, and you want to, and you want to. I done did everything to. She forgave me for everything. This is for everything. Hey, did I treat you like this? Harry amused himself for a while, turning the taps on and off, particularly enjoying the effect of one whose jet bounced off the surface of the water in large arcs. I wonder what you're doing precisely now. Possibly asleep, possibly eating, certainly not watching this. Compare this to an onsen, and you have the shimmer of light and water. It was so deep that his feet barely touched the bottom, and he actually did a couple of lengths before swimming back to the side and treading water, staring at the egg. Liberation from the smartphone and fear that something is happening somewhere else. Highly enjoyable though it was to swim in hot and foamy water with clouds of different colored steam wafting all around him. No string of brilliance came to him, no sudden burst of understanding, so much running water and the bubbling under stream. And you want stillness, but not in this moment. No, you are under the waterfall. I would bathe every morning as a child were Hemingway in this bath. It featured a blonde mermaid. There was also a diving board, long white wind linen curtains. On the Titanic, there was more than seven 700. I have not lived in a house with a proper bath. I have a little bath clarity right now. It had been a long year of work and leisure. The result can be a healthier you. You lay your head back against the edge of the bath. Victor's life heats.
lips a cauldron of water, I closed my eyes and felt wonderful. The feeling of cooling, endurance, duration, physics of displacement, maybe practice of personal hygiene. I would write more, get flow, use less electronics. I would go to Europe. I wonder what you're doing. We went lilowing. There are geothermal hot springs in many locations. The voice inside the soundscape is happy to be overcome. He could tell at once that they carried different sorts of bubble bath mixed with the feelings of clear and hot. A few things you didn't know about bathtubs. We all know bathtubs are a great way to soothe away aches and pains. So today, I thought I'd cover off a few things you didn't know. Giselle Bunchen gave birth in a bathtub. It's against the law for donkeys to sleep in bathtubs in Arizona. It would take 17,000 McDonald's strawfuls of water to fill a standard bathtub. Marilyn Monroe reportedly bathed in champagne, and it took a whopping total of 350 bottles to fill the bathtub. While the above is simply a list of random but interesting little-known facts about bathtubs to brighten up your day, there is one thing we know for sure. A bathtub is a great place to relax and unwind from the stresses of everyday life. There is even a long list of health benefits we can all experience from this one simple pleasure. But I might save that list for another day. It had been a glorious childhood, a hot spring. It was so deep that his feet barely touched the bottom. Highly enjoyable though it was to swim in hot and foamy water with different clouds of different colored steam wafting all around him, no stroke of brilliance came to him, no sudden burst of understanding so much running water and the bubbling under stream and you want stillness but not in this moment no you're under the waterfall consider the flow of the water and its description in writing you try to stay in the moment of it the crisp clear irretrievable yes the ah the simple inhalation and exhalation the everything the leisure the clarity and consider its irretrievability it is defined by the otherness to the rest of your variously confused life. Which is not to say that you are confused. Just not quite clear. Your body is full of toxins most of the time. But for now, you are in a bath. 